Hello and welcome to the tutorial for how to enter your statistics online. As you can see, I've already logged into my account and I'm at the home screen. From here, you'll click on the statistics tab where you'll be able to see all of your previous stats from months where you've already entered statistics. In order to enter new statistics, you'll scroll down to the bottom and click on the enter statistics button. This screen will look very familiar to the previous screen where you entered your statistics. Your first step will be to select a date. You will always select the last day of the month that you are entering statistics for. In this example, I will be submitting statistics for January 2014, so I will select January 31st. Also, I will be acting as a pantry in this example, which means I will be filling out fields 1 through 14. If you are not a pantry, please see the manual that we have online for which fields you are supposed to enter. Please bear with me as I enter some numbers. I intentionally left these two fields blank so that I can add them up and make sure that I have the correct numbers. We do suggest that before you submit your statistics, you double check the math for any errors. Total is 596. Now I'll come down here and do the same thing. and the total for this section is 52. I want to remind you that the numbers for your new household information are also reflected in the top part with total households. For example, for this pantry, they had 15 new households and 201 total households. So that means that there were 186 households that were already registered for this month for this pantry. 186 plus 15 equals 201, and that is where that number comes from. At this point, you will come down to the bottom and click on Submit Statistics. You will receive a confirmation screen, which will look like this, and you'll also have the option to click for a PDF summary of your statistics. As we previously saw, all of your statistics are in this tab, so don't feel like you need to print out a copy because you'll be able to do that at any time. That's the end of this tutorial. If you have any questions, feel free to call us. And have a good day. Bye.